It ain't the reverend's adversary. It ain't that woman over there in the black dress's adversary. It ain't that woman because she's got problems in her marriage's adversary. It ain't that woman because she got a sickness adversary. It's my adversary. If he ain't my adversary, then he must be my friend. Hello. Because it is Jesus said, your adversary, the devil, your adversary. And if you don't hate him, you must love him. And anything you hate, you ought to feel, your hair ought to stand up on the back of your neck like the hair of a dog sometime. When he talking to you, you ought to hear him talk to you. And you ought to know that this ain't the voice to follow and the audacity for you. So it must be stomping time. Christians are people who hear voices. Don't let nobody fool you and say you crazy. You hear voices. You supposed to hear voices. And you supposed to hear two voices. The voice of the wolf and the voice of the sheep. And if you ain't responding to either one, then you, you, your conscience has been seared. Something wrong with you. Because when you hear the voice of the sheep, shepherd, you're supposed to turn one way or the other. You're supposed to make a sound. Let him know I hear you, Lord. And you hear the voice of the wolf, you're supposed to talk back. You're supposed to do what your shepherd done. It is written. Somebody told you you're supposed to be sophisticated and don't say nothing. You're supposed to say it's written. He gave you an example. If you don't know how to do anything but say Satan, get behind me. You are not supposed to just sit there like Ernie on, on Sesame Street. You're supposed to say it is written or get behind me or I bind you in the name of Jesus. That's your religion that tells you to be dull about it. You're supposed to say get beneath my feet. You're supposed to say Satan, I plead the blood. But the one thing you ain't supposed to do is to be dull and without understanding. Jesus showed us the example when Satan came to him and says, cast these, uh, make these bread, these stones into bread. He didn't just say, I don't hear you, I don't hear you, because the world is teaching us to act like the devil don't exist to get victory. That ain't the way to defeat the devil. The way to defeat the devil is to be full of the word. And when he come at you to say, I hate Shana, you say, it's written. Because the devil being Leviathan like a snake, he can speak real fast. And he'll say, I hate, I dislike, I can't, I dis, and he'll get you with nine different sayings. And they'll pile up in your spirit until you say it's written. You see the snake? Snake don't spit one time his tongue out and don't spit never. Yada da, yada da, yada da, yada da, yada da. And if you, you want to get into warfare to win, you can't be religious. I, I, I don't hear you. You got to speak back. But the reason most of us won't, because we haven't studied the word and won't study the word, that's how you get him off you. When he tell you your family's going to be broke up. When he tell you your kid's going to be sick. When he tell you you're going to be out of work. When he, when he lays it on you, you're supposed to spit back because we're in spiritual warfare. And that's why he says the words that I give you, they are life. And they don't come to life just in that book. They come to life when you with breath say them. Praise him. And that's why he's bitten so many. Somebody come at you, you're supposed to come back with the word. 
And most of your battles is not with a person in a body talking to you. It's you by yourself, something talking to you in the air. So don't tell me you don't hear voices because he spoke to Eve and wasn't nobody there. It's the same old method. He catch you in the car, catch you in the bathroom, catch you in the bedroom, and he's talking. You know this going on. You know you ain't going to make it. You know you know, you know, you know, and you sit and listen all day. You sit, my, my mind told me, you're lying, the devil told you. Yeah. 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 Leviathan cannot be tamed, tied, or caught. The only way you can deal with him is you have to speak the word at him. That's the only thing he respect. He ain't respecting your hairdo, your, your, your clothing. In fact, you went to church. None of that means anything. Come on, praise the Lord. Don't get sleepy. Don't get, hey, come on. Don't, don't get distracted now. It's getting hot in here. Quenching the fire. Say this with me. Say it. It's on the screen. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Say with me, I quench the shield, I quench with the shield of faith. Every fiery dart the enemy sends my way. The shield of faith works with the word. Don't worry about writing this down. I'll get it to you later. Y'all will be here all day trying to write what I got for you today. Don't write it. Don't waste your time. You ain't going to catch up. If you, you want to know, ask me. I'll send it to you. Email, text message, whatever you got. Just focus. Say it with me one more time. I quench with the shield of faith. Every fiery dart. So the enemy, the devil is sending fiery darts. And the only way the shield of faith works is that you must speak the word. That's your purpose for reading the word every day. So you can quench with it. Jealousy, envy, anger, bitterness, and rage sent against my life in Jesus' name. I quench it with the shield of faith. Come on, lift up your voice right now and say, I quench this. I quench jealousy. Those of you that may be watching, you can do this. Come on, I quench envy. You see it on the screen? Come on, you can read. Help me here. I quench bitterness and rage sin against my life. That's the breakfast of champions. Let them eggs and bacons wait. This is what you need in the morning. Come on, say this with me. I quench every fire the enemy would throw into my sanctuary. In Jesus' name. You know what a sanctuary is? Your heart. <laughs> That's not necessarily a church building. It can be that too, or where you worship. But my heart is a sanctuary. If I can't present my heart to him, can't no fire get in there. I quench every fire the enemy would put in there. And he would like to put strange fire in there. God's not going to dwell in a place where there's a strange fire. If I got a fire in there for something that God, the Holy Ghost, is jealous, he's not going to dwell there too. And there's another fire beating there. And, and many people, God's people that way. There's something else in there more passionate. He's a jealous God. God is like, I'm trying to get in there. And there's something else crowding me out. It's like having two people. God don't do a tree, 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 triage, whatever you call it. Menage a trois. And a whole lot of Christians trying to get God to do that. He don't do that. He said, my name is Jealous. Say it with me. I bind and cast out every fiery serpent sin against my life in Jesus' name. Come on, do it with me. Say it. I bind and cast out. Praise God. Do you believe that? Yeah. First of all, do you believe that fiery serpents are sin against you? Yeah. A whole lot of Christians don't believe it. Amen. I quench every burning lamp that comes from Levithan's mouth. My, my, my head my ear ain't no garbage dump for your, your lies. Lies about me. Think about it. Lies about my life, my future, my past, my friends, my family, my children, my health. Oh, come on. 
Let's take a moment and do that. You know, he didn't lie to you about your children, your health, you, you, you know, your singleness. Come on. Your marriage, your kids. Y'all act like I'm lying. Y'all looking at me strange. I bind every spell. Say it with me. I bind every spell. I bind all voodoo. Say it. All voodoo. All voodoo. This is October. The witches is already working on some of us. Stand on your feet for a minute. You can sit down. This ain't no seance. Get rid of your religion. I bind all witchcraft. Come on. They busy. Find your space. Turn around three times. Do what you got to do. But you need to shake yourself. Y'all looking at me. I'm not a magician. I bind every spell put on my life by past lovers, former lovers, friends, drugs, alcohol, television, people that left me, people that's with me now, every spell, spells in the clothing, folk that drug some in the house. In Jesus' name, y'all better come on. Y'all better come on. Y'all better come on. Come on, come on. Oh, y'all gonna y'all gonna make the devil mad. I bind stuff that's on trinkets. Gadgets. Unclean spirits. Electronics, amen. Yeah. Stuff. People touching stuff, Tuff, touching me. Come on. I bind people that done bumped into me got the wrong spirit on them. Way we transmit power is through touch. Through the eye gate, through the ear gate, through the touch gate. Did you know, did you not know that? I bind spirits that came at me through the eyes. Transmission can come through the eyes. Waking spirits, lustful spirits through the eyes. Come on, y'all better fight with me. I came to fight today for somebody. Maybe it ain't y'all, but it's for them. Waking spirits. Swish swash spirits, whatever they call. Spirits with the body. Motion spirits, y'all better come on. Enticing spirits. Because you saved don't mean they ain't coming at you. Oh, lying spirits. Whispering spirits. How you think they lure you? Whispering spirits. Coming at you. Whispering spirits. Seductive spirits. Seductive spirits. They ain't got the Holy Spirit and they just touching all on you. How you think it go down? How you think it go down? They ain't got the Holy Spirit there all over you. I bind that. I don't know where them fingers been. I don't know where them hands been. I don't know where them tongues been. I don't know where them lips been. Come on, somebody. I don't know whose genitals them lips been on. I said it. I don't know what witch they done kissed. I didn't come to play. I don't know. Spirit. I'm, I, I don't know where you been. I don't know where your feet been and whose house they been in. That's why God's people is bound and Satan has, has hindered them from being able to be filled with the Holy Ghost and they got their mind all twisted.
And y'all think the preacher being ugly, but God's trying to break the witchcraft off of us so we can get the Holy Ghost because you can't put the Holy Ghost in vessels. I don't know where your organs have been. You don't join Christ's body to a harlot. That's in your word. That's witchcraft. That's witchcraft. That ain't got nothing to do with God. Christ and Belial don't come together. So you can't whisper to me. You can't put your tongue on me. Don't even put your filthy hands on me. I don't know who you touched. Jesus even told Mary, don't touch me. I have not ascended to my father. So when you want to have God's power in your life, you won't lay with, talk to, walk with just anybody unless you got power to deal with them. Did you hear what I said? It ain't judging. It's discerning. If he in you ain't greater, then don't lie with him, walk with him, or talk with him. You can't give me a holy kiss and your lips been around somebody's genitals. Greet <laughs> one another with a holy kiss. And you ain't got to write me about that either. Because the only way that marriage is honorable and the bed undefiled. But sinners and whoremongers, God will judge. And when you want the power of the Spirit in your life, you will cut yourself off. And I don't care if Levithon got a boat full of money. You ain't going to let him whisper in your ear. You ain't going to let your poison in my lobe. Because if it get in my lobe, it's going to get in my heart. And if it get in my heart, it's going to get in my feet. And it's going to separate me from him that died on the cross for me. And I was born in the spirit to tread on serpents and scorpions. That means snakes and stuff that like to speak with forked tongues. Stuff that like to lie. Love in revelations to love to make a lie. And love a lie and make a lie. He that love the tongue go eat the fruit of it. I was born to step on snakes. Burn me once, shame on you. Burn me twice, shame on me. And I done been burnt by the enemy. I will not be burned by the fire of the enemy. Come on, praise him. I overcome every fiery trial. Say it with me. Sin by the enemy against my life. Turn up the heat seven times hotter than hot. Come on, I wish I had a prayer in church. Turn your heat up. If God bring me to it, he can bring me through it. I will not be burned up by this trial. If you hear me screaming, 
I'm going to be screaming to the Lord. I ain't going to say, Lord, master devil, stop. Come on, praise him with me. Say it with me. The enemy will not be able to burn up my harvest. Say it. I quench every fire of wickedness since again my life. Use your tongues, children. I quench all ungodly words spoken against me. <coughs> Come on, say it. I quench it. Pour this for me. Pour that for me. Take a moment and stay there. <laughs> Everything, go ahead, get it. Everything that's been said about me is ungodly. <laughs> Every place my name been cast out ungodly. Come on. I don't care if it's on the job, in the church, in my family. Come on. I quench all ungodly words spoken against my life. Come on. I reverse the words spoken against me. Come on. I quench every torch the enemy will use against my life. Come on. You better fight for your own life here. The enemy got a blowtorch against your life. Come on, against your health, against your finances, against your days. He done put assignment on you to drive you crazy. You better fight back. Your mama can't help you. You better fight back. I blow out the enemy's torch by the power of the Holy Ghost. Tell him, Satan, put your weapons away. I quench all gossip directed against my life. Come on, you would tell, tell the devil, you wasted your time. Like, like David said when he danced, I'm going to get even more dig indignified. Come on. The enemy's flame would not kindle upon me. Come on, say it. This your life. Come on, say I break curses. Come on, children, I break curses over me. Wave your hand over your own life. I do, I break curses over me. I don't need you to judge me. I break curses over my own life. Curses over me. My tendencies, stuff that I might used to do. I break curses. I break the curses that anybody might speak over me. Say it. And I break curses over me. I'm not walking in no curse. I'm not intimidated by no curse. My God, I'm not intimidated by curses. I'm not walking in no curse. Curses of sickness. Financial curses. Loneliness. Despair, anger, murder, wickedness, vileness. What's the worst thing the devil told you could happen to you? I break the lie of that curse. I'm not going to bed in fear. I'm not waking up in fear. I'm not running when ain't nothing chasing me. I'm not afraid of the dark. I'm not afraid of nothing. But God, come on. I'm not afraid of cancer. I'm not afraid of heart attacks. Say I'm not afraid of a stroke. I don't care what's been in my family. I break curses. I'm going in the rapture. I got to find another way to answer the doctor when he asked me how folk died in my family. Because I ain't speaking no curses over us. I'm redeemed from the curse through the blood. Come on. Y'all at home can say this too. I'm bald, y'all. I ain't playing church. I'm redeemed. He got the receipt on me. Say it. I'm the seed of Abraham. His blessing is mine. I choose blessings instead of cursing. 
Life instead of death. Say it. Let's move that mountain. Life instead of death. Abundant life. Come on. You ain't building no grave for me. My God. I saw a vision of myself the other night and I had a head full of white hair. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Y'all better come on. Tonight's only been under my chin, but I had a head full of white hair. I had a dream, a head full of white hair. That was a gift to me in my sleep. Somebody asked me if I dyed my hair on top. No. It's been white on the bottom, but I had a dream that the whole top was hoary frost. Hallelujah. Y'all better come on with it. I shall not die, but live and declare. Since I've been saying this, I walk better. The joy of the Lord is my strength. Y'all better say it. I throw those burial plans away, bro. I don't open them. I throw them in the trash. I'm not interested. Said I should not die but live. Ain't no plague taking me. I'm full of the Holy Ghost. Ain't no what ifs. Look at your name and say, can't nobody do my job? I'm breaking general, generational curses over my life. We got a great cloud of witness. All my kinfolk visit me in my dreams and say, go ahead.